Hey guys, I'm back. It's Colin or Devil Rooster 77 here, and today I'm bringing you guys a highlight video of um, TCU versus Oklahoma. Let's bring this out. Right, let's fold this. Anyway, TCU coming into the game, 25th ranked. Oklahoma, 4th ranked in the country. And um, TCU with the upset, 37 33. Gary Patterson and TCU finally have a big attention grabbing victory in the Big 12 Conference. The former BCS Boston Horned Frog sent a quiet message, or quite a message, in their third Big, o tw big 12 opener, getting Paul Dawson 41 interception return for a touchdown, and a big fourth down stop in the fourth quarter in their victory over Oklahoma. TCU now 4 now. Uh, there's more there. I, would, uh, I didn't want to stay, so um, that's pretty much it. Um, I probably could do another video right now, or another highlight video. So let's do that right now. Um, let's do Auburn versus LSU, the two Tiger games coming into this game. And um, Nick Marshall passed for 207 yards, ran for 119, and accounted for four touchdowns to lead host Auburn to a blowout of LSU. Auburn 5-0, 2-0, dominating from the start. The 41 points equaled Auburn's highest total in the rivalry. Set the same margin in the 1999 game, LSU 4-2, which turned the freshman quarterback Brandon Harris, who dropped in his first two SEC games for the first time in coach Les Miles' decade. Long tenure. Harris compromised three or four passes into the eight yards before getting replaced late in the third quarter by Anthony Jennings. That was a very big shock for me. I went to bed. It was pretty big. I didn't know what the score was. I I was watching football. I didn't really care at that point. It was 17-7 when I lost. So I, so I guess I was never scored again. Um, that's all I have to say about that. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. And uh, check back for more when we go back and do a highlight video of the Mississippi games. Anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys all later.